This story actually began two years ago. A Montgomery County police officer plowed into a woman in a municipal parking lot and Action News has now obtained exclusive video of the accident. Investigative reporter Chad Perdelli sat down with the victim and dug through all kinds of records throughout the Delaware Valley to find out exactly what happened, really to get the story behind the story. Yeah, Jim, the officer clearly didn't see the pedestrian, but why? We wanted to know what this officer was doing. Was he on his phone? We tried to get answers, and we warn you, the accident is graphic. It was a warm June night. Upper Marion Township's annual Concerts Under the Star series was underway. Natasha Shahu walked along cars in a parking lot when this happened. I'm very lucky. I am alive. Shahu describes the accident like a tornado hitting. On the video, she staggers up, clearly in pain, and asks Officer James Siegfried, didn't you see me? He told me I hit you. I said, I'm going to die. Either of the guys on the ambulance. I said, are you sure I'm going to survive? I don't want it to die. I'm too young. I remember those words. My client, Mrs. Shahu, is wearing a bright yellow top. There are no obstructions. There's absolutely no reason that if this gentleman was paying attention that he couldn't have avoided this accident. When attorney Todd Jacobs brought the video to Action News, we reviewed it and determined it to be simply an accident. But a closer look at the police report and it seems investigators are trying to blame the 53 year old for being mowed down. The police report states Officer Siegfried admits he didn't see Shahu, but the majority of it focuses on the parking lot being clearly a restricted area. They take a statement and prepare a police report, which frankly is one of the most self-serving, biased documents I've read in 12 years of practicing law. Shahu had just left the summer concert at the township building with her husband, daughter, and grandkids. The township's public parking lot was bustling with families. An ice cream truck even patrolled the grounds. Officer Siegfried, at one point, stops to allow a dad and his child pass by. The victim says the concert had just ended. She was helping her daughter and young grandchildren get to their car. Her husband was in an upper parking lot. He told her it was congested and he couldn't get to her. So she tried to make her way to him and then got lost. And she says she didn't realize she was in a restricted area. Simply being in the wrong place at the wrong time in no way permits an officer to run you down with his vehicle. Upper Marion Police and a private attorney retained by the township declined comment, citing pending litigation. Action News submitted right to know requests to Camden County, Wilmington and Philadelphia Police Departments to find out how often police hit pedestrians. We found them to be rare. Shahu says she suffered a broken hand torn ankle tendon, along with months of back and neck pain. She says she incurred $30,000 in medical expenses. She and her attorney say the township has only offered $20,000. The township here has been unfair. And the sign entering the police parking lot says police only, but does that mean just vehicles or also pedestrians? We had many questions, but again, police are not commenting pending uh, because of the pending litigation. Any idea at all how long this litigation is going to take? I guess it's hard to know. It's tough to say in civil, in civil matters. Right. It could drag out or it could be settled rather quickly. You'll keep on it. Yes. Thanks. All right. Thank you.